Hi, I'm Jean Gear, and I'm here with Rob Winterbottom from Blue Rasta. Hey, Rob. Hey, how's how are you on? doing? Good, good. Yeah, that's great. So, tell me a little bit about Blue Rasta and what you guys do. So, Blue Raster, we're an application development company. We build web applications, mobile applications. Uh, we also help people with data. So, if you have a lot of data that you need to do some analysis with, or you just need help kind of figuring out the best way to visualize it, um, we can help out with all that stuff too. What else three tools would you say have helped you the most? So, uh, I'm personally a JavaScript developer, and that's where I do most of my work. Um, so, JavaScript API would probably be the biggest one. But we're also using things like uh, App Studio. We're starting to look at uh, Xamarin uh, now that you guys are going to have an SDK for that as well. So um, probably mostly some of the runtime SDKs and the JavaScript API. So tell me about your work with story maps and how you're using that. So we've done a couple of lightweight story maps where we'll just take some data, put it in ArcGIS Online, and then use one of the uh, standard story map templates. Um, but lately, we've actually gone a little bit further, and we've built our own custom story map template that we've shared across the organization. You chose Story Maps uh, for this customer. Was there a reason why you chose Story Maps? Did it have to do with how they were planning to distribute it? Or can you talk about that? Yeah. So um, I think that was definitely one of the main reasons was they wanted to they wanted to be able to just kind of rebrand it and and create their own web maps and have their own data, but have the same kind of theme and. Uh, same kind of analysis available to all of them, but they didn't want to have to do like a new custom application every time. So it was initially a, a really simple story map, and it, it's grown a lot in complexity and in, in the functionality that it can do. But um, I think originally it was just that they wanted to be able to uh, just start spinning up new and new uh, application templates, essentially, and uh, hosting them for the various uh, various users. Well, thanks so much. It was great talking with you. You as well. Thank you.